Hi, this is a tutorial series on InMotion, which is a motion and dynamic simulation add-in for Autodesk Inventor. In this tutorial, we'll consider oscillatory motion. Earlier, we had given constant rotation, which can be accessed from uh, this uh, insert one, which is listed under motions. We click on oscillatory mo rotation. We give a uh, hertz, that is cycles per second, and we give one amplitude. We give as 180 degrees and the offset we give as 0 ok then we go to simulation player since simulator data already exists playback deck comes which was corresponding to the previous simulation we go to simulator we click on start sim simulation which will uh, start simulating for the current uh, configuration of assembly and if, uh, if you want to stop you can click on this after stopping if you want to go back to the previous input configuration you can click on this particular uh, uh, button. Once the simulation stops, the playback button will be enabled. Okay, we go to playback deck. We increase the speed. Then uh, we click on play forward. As you can see, this can be considered as zero position of the crank. This is a zero position, and uh, the according to the motion of harmonic it is y equals a sin omega t minus phi where uh, we had given uh, a as amplitude 180 degree it goes from almost 0 to 180 degrees and again it comes back and omega in our case would be 2 pi f t that is uh, f is the frequency which has which we have given as 1 time would be time in seconds and minus phi is the phase difference which we have given as 0 so now it will go it it went from 0 to 180 then again it comes back to 0 and goes in the negative direction now it will reach at the minus 180 and again it will come back to 0 this is how uh, sim harmonic motion uh, behaves we'll cover other features in coming videos thanks for watching